Okay, so now that we got our, our backdrop installed and set up, we ready to roll. And we're back to the bins. So we're gonna take this bin off. It's got our printer in it, our props, paper and ink. This right here has the actual photo booth in it. So this is a Pelican case. Very secure, holds everything tight, cushioned and well. How you unlock it? Got this, snap it, snap it, snap it. You got one more on here, snap it. One more on this side, snap it. That's gonna open it up. This is the contents. So we got our base plate for the photo booth itself sitting in his own cushion. We're gonna put that to the side. Now we got our poles. We got three poles. We got our umbrella for the strobe. We got our pole to hold the actual strobe that has a screw on the end to lock it in. With all the screws, you make sure you, once you use them, you take them off, fasten them, and once you're not using them, you put them right back on where they need to be. So this is the pole for the stroke. This is to the tool you need to tighten the poles with. We got our keypad. We got an extra Allen wrench as well. So we can pull that up. Set that to the side as well. So we got our base plate, poles. This is our printer stand. It's for the printer. Set that to the side. And we got one more foam plate. We pull this up. Put that, and just kind of store that right there. And then we got our photo booth head, and we got our strobe. And that's what all the contents of the Pelican case for the photo booth. All right. So how you assemble this is... How I do it, I'm gonna actually put it back together. Boom, that plate goes down, printing stand goes next. And you got this, you can tell, cause it got the hole right in the middle. That's where your printing stand kind of slide right in. And you got your base plate. Okay, so once I open this, I'm going to take the base plate out. Put that kitchen right there and store it. So this is the back. It says the back because it got the, the stoppers. And then we got our two holes. This is the hole for the actual photo booth. This is the hole for the printer. So what we do, take our printer stand. Screw is at the bottom. Take the screw out. Take that screw. We know we're gonna put the printer at the front. The front is the skinnier part of the base. And then the back is where you put the photo booth head at. So this is gonna go towards the fatter part. Skinnier part for the printer, fatter part for the uh, actual photo booth. So this is the Stand for the printer, got the screw. What we do, take the base plate, take say a screw, I'm just gonna kinda put it in that hole, slide it through. Take our Allen wrench, kinda place that right there, put that right there. And I'm just gonna screw it in. Screwing that in tight. You don't want to get it too tight, but it can't move. So, boom. Good thing to do is each pole has a hole in it. So, make sure the hole is facing the, 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 this hole in the back or the fat part of the base. 
So boom, now it's tight. Can't move. Hole is facing the back of this hole. All right. Make sure it's tight. Use that Allen wrench. Don't strip it though, but you want to make sure it's tight. All right. Now we take. This is the pole for the actual head of the machine. You know that because it actually has these ribbons on it. So the poles for the head have the red ribbons right here and right there. There we go. All right, so we're doing the same thing. Nail at the bottom, screw that out. base plate. Remember the pole for the head goes closest to the, the fattest part of the base. So same thing, screw here, slide in that hole. I got an Allen wrench. I'm gonna kind of place that there. Take the Allen wrench in your hand, twisting. Take this pole, kind of feel it, and do the same thing. Remember this hole, we wanted to face the, the back of this hole. So that's where you kind of want it. And I'm just gonna twist it tight. Twist it up. Make sure everything is facing it. Boom. And that's your base right there. Your base is complete. Now, that second pole for the head of the machine See this little switch right here. What we're gonna do is just kind of push this on, push it down. So we get it right here and twist it, lock it in. There we go. And we got printer stand. This is the pole for the head of the machine. And we're gonna go back to our bin. Put my Allen wrench back. Always put things back where they're supposed to be so you won't lose them. All right, lift this cushion part up. So now our printer stand, same situation. See that little divot? What we're gonna do is put that right there, slide it down so it kind of lock in right there. And there you go. Printer stand, and this is for the head of the machine, the photo booth head.